guys welcome or welcome back to our youtube channel in today's video i'm going to be doing a haul of some of the items that i got for the girls we're just gonna go ahead and start unboxing these so i'm going to start with this box and we're gonna see what's in it i have an idea of what might be in it also any items that have a link i will leave the link for them in the description down below Okay, I know what this is. So, the first thing we have here is just this Christmas tree hat out. And this is so adorable. I saw this on Amazon quite a long time ago. And I wanted to get it so bad. So, I decided to get it for the girls for Christmas. And I'm so excited because this is literally so adorable. This next item is just like a tunnel and this kind of reminds me of the brand Homea, their tunnel, because um, this is like the same plastic method. So and it looks like there's like a seal. Looks like it came with two pee pad type mats for the inside, which is cool. This is so fuzzy, oh my gosh. Like this is the tunnel all put together, and this is literally so adorable. I love the Christmas design and I love the little leaves. They almost remind me of like a little forest, so. This is very cute. I love this item. This next item I've actually gotten before, but I do think that this is from a different brand. So I'm curious to see the size. I got it in the largest size possible. So I really hope it will fit the girls. This is definitely on the smaller side for sure, um, but I mean, it was a pretty good deal. Um, I don't know how Lola is going to fit in this. Uh, I do think Noelle is going to fit in this. It is kind of small, but um, hopefully the girls will fit inside this nicely. It's definitely going to be very cozy. And I just love the ears. I think it's so adorable. Also, once again, there are links for these items in the description. Next, we are moving on to Dollar Store. And I literally am obsessed with the Dollar Store. I go there for like all of my decorations. I just, they are so amazing. And everything is such a good deal. So I'm very excited to show you guys what we got from the Dollar Store. First thing is a garland, and this is so adorable, and I have so many ideas of what I can do with this. I'm just, like, so excited, and I really love this, and this was only a dollar, which is a pretty good deal. I'm so excited to put this somewhere. I'm not completely sure where I'm going to put it yet, but I am so excited. Once again, I got garland, and I went ahead and went on a limb for this. I'm not exactly sure how well this is going to match. It definitely has some color pop, but I had some cute ideas of what I could do with this. So we're just gonna go ahead and see if we can do anything with this. And I thought, why not? Cause it was literally only a dollar. So I'm very excited to see if we can do anything cool with this. And I think the snowman and the candy cane colors are so cute. This next thing I got is a bell, and I have a really cute idea for this. I'm going to put it, like, on the girls' enclosure somewhere, and I think it looks very festive, and it's just so adorable, and yeah, I just went ahead and got this for the girls' enclosure. 
The next thing I got were these little flower ornament gold type things and these are pretty cute and I thought they were adorable little Christmas decorations. I thought they would go cute with something, maybe be a tree topper, so we're gonna see if we can do anything with these. The first thing is this little mini Christmas tree and it definitely doesn't have a lot of full branches, but I thought it was cute and I have a idea of where I could put this. So we're just gonna go ahead and see if we can do anything fun with this little tree. Next are these little bell ornaments and I got these for the mini Christmas tree because they were the tiniest ornaments they had and I thought they were very cute. So we're gonna see if we can hang these on the little tree. The next thing I got were these stickers and I was thinking I could stick them on Taffy's enclosure or stick them on the girls enclosure. So we're gonna go ahead and see what we can do with these and I think they're so adorable. Next, I got these two signs to hang up by the girls enclosure and I could not choose between the two. So I just decided to get both because they are so adorable. So I'm probably gonna like switch these out and see which ones go best. And Ginger seems very interested. The next thing I got were these lights and these are pretty cute. I was thinking of putting them on the garland or the Christmas tree, but it looks like they have a green like light strand. So I'm thinking I may not put them on the Christmas tree. I think I'm just gonna put them on the garland, but only a dollar. I thought this was a good deal. So I just went ahead and got these. The next thing I got was this little like, I think it's a bowl and it's Christmas tree shaped. And I thought this would be really cool to put some of Taffy's substrates in. So I am very excited for that. It's so adorable and it's a decent size. The depth is probably like three or four inches, maybe five. So I thought this would be very festive for Taffy's enclosure to help spice it up because it's a little bit more difficult to decorate Taffy's enclosure because I tend to do more natural themes. The very last thing I got was this gingerbread man tin. I thought this was so adorable and I have a very fun video idea and I thought this would go good with it. So make sure to stay tuned for that video. The last thing we got are more Christmas lights because you can never have enough Christmas lights. And I have an idea for these and I'm once again so excited for all of this. So we're gonna see what we can do with these lights. Next, I'm gonna be showing you guys the items that I made. I just have a tunnel in this fleece print and I think this is so adorable and it's pretty big and I think it turned out so cute and I'm so excited to see what the girls think of it and yeah. Next we just have a pee pad. This is a larger pee pad and it turned out so cute and I'm very excited to use it. Next we just have more pee pads. I made quite a few. We're not going to go through each and every one but I think there's like five or six pee pads. Next we just have three beds and these are so adorable and I think the girl's gonna love them. The fleece is super cozy. Last, we just have a fleece forest and these are so classic with our cage themes and I love them so much. I literally make them in every single print I have and I am so excited to use this in the girl's enclosure. As well as we have this bed from last year. We did not make this, we bought it from Walmart, but I am still going to be using this bed if I can fit it in because I love it so much. This is everything we got to decorate the girls and closure for this year. I am so excited, so make sure to stay tuned for that video. It will be coming out this Saturday, so make sure to turn on the notification bell so that you will not miss it. I'm so excited to decorate this year, and yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to tell us in the comments below. Once again, links in the description to all of the items. Is a garden. <laughs> Hi, you're so cute, Ginger. Ginger is so interested in everything. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know what this is. I think it's a bowl. <laughs> what do you smell? You're so cute. <laughs>